Hey, good morning, David. Mike Peterson from Mark Ward Toyota in Chippewa Falls. How you doing? Here, I'll spin around and say hi. Hey, it's nice to meet you. Kind of a blustery, yucky Wisconsin morning up here. Hope it's warm down in your neck of the woods. I wanted to give you a better, closer look on this vehicle. It's pretty cool. There's that uh, kind of how you ride aligned the uh, the rims. Looks pretty tough. Tires, BF Goodrich, all the way around on it. Tons of tread left. Uh, I'll endeavor to show you everything on it. Just little blemishes here and there. Obviously, it's a 10-year-old vehicle. For a 10-year-old unit, it's super solid. It's not perfect, but overall, just like little stuff like this. Little scratches. There's a little bit of delamination of the plastic on these flares, which really, those things can be obviously fixed or replaced pretty easy, but uh, there's that. I'd like to show you the rims of the tires all the way around. Uh, spin around here. The hard top looks to be in real good shape. A couple of little marks on it, but nothing major. He right aligned this whole back, the rack and the uh, bumper on this. I'm assuming it started to rust a little bit. As you can see, it's kind of bubbling underneath there, but it's solid as a rock uh, with uh, that Rhino liner on there. So pretty good idea. Mark here, just a couple little scratches, just stuff like that. Uh, right here, there is a, a line that looks like you did uh, some re, uh, uh, painted, uh, what do you want to call it? Touch-up paint on there. I can't think here on Monday morning. There's that rim and tire. There's a little bit more of that delamination on that flare. Not a big deal. A little scratch. But this door has got a couple of things on it. This is probably, and it's certainly not bad, but it's some spots that he touched up on here. Just little marks there, there. And then it's hard to see it, but see it right there along my finger? There's kind of a, a deep, it, it's, I think he touched it up. It's a little bit of a scratch slash kind of a, it's almost got kind of a slight indentation to it. I'm sitting right here again. It's not bad at all for the year. Uh, another little spot right there. There's that rim and tire. This fire looks pretty good overall. Show you the front end. You rhino line that front uh, bumper on there as well. Pretty cool looking. Obviously, I'm assuming the room for a winch here. Kind of has those inserts uh, as well. The hood has got, um, as you can see, see on top of it there. I don't know if it's got, if there was some pitting on it and then he repainted just the hood or or what happened. That's my guess is because there's some little pits in there and he did it just to reseal it. But I don't think anything's broken through. But as you can tell, kind of right there, you can kind of see up uh, there right along the edge of it there. So, not the end of the universe. Just little blemishes here and there. Oh, a couple little more spots there. He was real diligent about touching them up. If there were any little spots anywhere, he uh, he touched them all up, which is pretty awesome. All right, take a quick peek at the inside. Just so you know, too, this one, by law in Wisconsin, we have to put anything right here on this disclosure that's uh, mechanically wrong with it. There's not one thing mechanically wrong. And then this does have a one month, 1,000 mile bumper to bumper warranty uh, with it. So uh, if anything happened in that first month or 1,000 miles, uh, it's taken care of. No more than $100 uh, out of your pocket. Obviously it has to be done here though. So since you're so down, far down south, that might be a, a bit of an issue, but just so you can rest easy, this thing is, is solid. Interior, real nice shape. Get that pad up there with the speakers and the lights on the roll bar. Let me show you the rest of it. David, I really appreciate your interest and uh, hopefully this uh, this awesome rig warrants a trip up from down south, okay? Take care. Thank you. Talk to you soon.